After North Tulsa nonprofit Children's Center looking for their van tonight, Special Kids Learning Center's director says that someone stole it, and now she doesn't know how they're going to get the children from school to the center. Tune is reporter Joe Hankey live with where the center staff last saw the van. Joe? Well, Karen, missing for nearly 30 hours now. Right now I'm standing in her parking spot. This is where staff here at Special Kids Learning Center parked this donated 1984 Dodge Ram van. They named Big Bertha, and right now they tell me they don't know where she is. Put your shoes in your cubby, please. Okay. Put them in your cubby. Joanne Williams' job is to help children at Special Kids know. Learning Center. My animal is out. But now she is the one who needs a little help. You know how you laugh because there's nothing else you can do? I just started laughing. Williams barreling down Highway 11 in Big Bertha yesterday, but between the Lewis and Harvard exits, Bertha began to feel sick. Big Bertha overheated, so we went and got water and put water in, and um, she was still really hot. Left on the side of the road to cool down, Williams and her staff used their own cars to get children from school to the learning center. But when Williams came to pick Big Bertha up, she couldn't find her. Pretty devastating, yeah. Um, I just can't believe someone would want to even steal her. Well, we love her, but she's ugly. And she sticks out like a sore thumb. At the center, these children's parents say Big Bertha let them stay at work. What's the matter, Zari? Come here. Well, staff picked their kids up from school. I mean, you got to be a pretty low person to steal from a daycare and especially their van. Now Williams. Miss Lisa would be very proud of you. Who dedicates herself to these children is struggling to make ends meet. A van is a big ticket item. It's just not in our reach. So we're kind of heartbroken. Heartbroken and missing Big Bertha, the ugly van so many relied on. Now Williams tells me she made calls yesterday to make sure Big Bertha simply wasn't towed away and with no trace of Big Bertha anywhere, she tells me she filed a police report and right now is simply praying that someone somewhere will find a way to help, help the children inside the center. Live in North Tulsa tonight, Joe Henke, 2 News works for you.